Well, hello, hello everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Miss Crochet and Coffee here. And today we're back with a <gasps> unboxing or unbagging. This one, of course, comes to us from the folks over at DIY Moon Shop. I love the special little things they do to your, your packages. So let's get into this package. I hope you guys are all having a wonderful, wonderful day. As you already know, if you've ever ordered from DIY Moon Shop or have seen them unbox them or do their reverse unboxings on their channel, which I will link their channel in the description box. Um, if you've ever seen them do the reverse unboxing, you know that they package their stuff very well. And right now with everything that's going on in the world, packaging or shipping is taking a little bit longer than expected. So like it's slowing a lot of these companies down. So please be patient as they try to bring you the best quality that they can. But with that said, we're going to attempt to get into this package because as I said, they package it really good and it's going to be a struggle. So, it's uh, a lot of tape. So I know a lot of people were asking what happened to the unboxing of this. This was something that uh, was not unboxed on their channel, I don't believe. So I there's no unboxing for it. But they wanted to show a couple of new things coming to their shop. So I was happy to oblige. So I'm going to get into this. Oh, I'm stabbing it and stabbing it. Trying not to stab through the paper. Because I don't know what all is in here. There we go. So I like the little ribbon. So we're going to keep the little ribbon if we can... Tape do y'all use? Does it have a picture of Sylvester Stallone on it? Good God. All right. Y'all. The feds couldn't get into this package, okay? So we're going to cut that. There we go. I love the little special touches. There we go. And of course, it has a DIY moon sticker on it. We're gonna get it out of the paper. So yeah, so if you've never had a DIY Moon Shop, uh, they do package their stuff very, very well to make sure nothing happens to it because it does come from the Philippines. So, <gasps> here we go. Ooh, okay, all right, all right. I see Howie Green. <gasps> Kathy Delonce. Oh my God. <gasps> Lotus in hand? Okay, all right, all right. So if you're watching this when I put it up, we are in the time of a pandemic. And if you didn't already see, DIY Moonshop has started adding masks to their repertoire of stuff that they they uh, allow you to order now. So I was sent a couple of masks to show you. Well, technically they just sent some masks. So the first one, or we have a bag pouch here. And I'm guessing it's to keep your mask in. And they do recommend that you wear the surgical mask underneath it. So this one is Artist Collective DIY Moon Shop. This one is the De L J. Okay, I can't pronounce the name, but that artwork. The Lotus, the hand coming out of the Lotus. Absolutely gorgeous. It has a matching little tote bag with it. Love that. I'm going to put it on my face just to make sure it, it fits my face. I have a big head, so, you know, you got to make sure it's for all the people's. Ooh, that's a decent mask. Okay. Oh, yeah, that fits. That fits. That's perfect. So, there it is. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, my gosh. And then, of course, our very own Cafe de Lance and Howie Green. I want to make sure I'm saying this name correctly. And I've seen, I think I've seen, uh... Does it come in rainbow with this this canvas right now? But that Cafe de Lance, oh my God, that artwork is beautiful. So they were able to put it on masks with matching bags for you to keep it in. And again, they give you the surgical mask to put underneath that just to, for a little extra protection. You know what I mean? So there was that. So then we have this. Oh, we got something here. Oh, snap. And then they have a large DIY moon shop uh, mask. I won't have to worry about masks, tell you that. And uh, just from common knowledge that I've had since I've had my Cricut, that's a really nice looking mask. And it fits, it fits perfectly. Yes, I love that. Just from what I know from, uh, and I can smell the alcohol on it. 
Uh, that, that's because I had it on my face. But just for what I know from making stuff with my Cricut, uh, this is probably something you're going to want to machine wash cold to make sure that the vinyl doesn't start to peel off. So there is that. So we got a couple of masks in there. We're going to take this trash, put it off to the side here. We got a little snack size painting here. So let's see what we got. Okay. Oh, <laughs> okay. One, one. They put my name on the bottom. I think they like it, so they had to put my name on it. Two. They're coming out with, think, I believe, with something new called I've Got Candy Collection. Uh, I'm not exactly 100% sure uh, how this works, but you get this really cool holographic toolkit with, like, the look at the iridescent colors on it. So you get a toolkit, and your toolkit will have... It looks like it has a seven placer, a plate of wax, a pink pen, and a pair of cheapo tweezers. Y'all don't care about that. And then here we go. Here's the image that they sent out for me. Look at the whale. Aw. And it says Van Gogh never saw Alaska. And with the I Like Candy collection, this looks to be a full freaking rhinestone. Now, if you didn't know, DIY Moon Shop works with floating legends. So their legends are floaters. So you won't get them attached to your canvas. You'll get them separately in a bag like this. Okay, I know you're looking at those math, but you got to focus. So there are all your numbers there. So you have one through eight, and then A through Z, and then lowercase and some uh, some symbols. And there it is. Van Gogh never seen a, never saw Alaska. And as you can see, it's all rhinestones. So let's take a look at all the beautiful rhinestones that were in this image. And it's a little, it's a little 30 by 30. Okay, so it has 45 colors. And this is Aja Tariri, I believe is her name. I might be butchering her name, but I'll have it pop up on the screen for you. Um so, yeah, so this is a full rhinestone kit. Look at this. Full rhinestone. Now, rhinestone kits are some of my favorite kits. One, because they sparkle a little brighter because they're all shiny diamond rhinestone. You know what I mean? There will be a special link for you to get this painting. So if you would like to get this painting, I will have a special link down below that will take you directly to the painting. So, because they did give me a special link to give to you guys for the painting. So, here we go. So, we have, and I love the numbers on the bags. So, we have easy inventory going on here. So, we can do the inventory real quick. Eight. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. Look at the colors, you guys. Oh my gosh. And since this is a little snack size painting, look how little and adorable that is. Like, okay, like my foot's bigger than this image. I'll probably be starting this one next after uh Eternal Love because it's just so little and cute. So 21, 22, 23. Get that out of here. 42. 43, 41, 40, 39, 19, 18, there's 7, 24. Now, the only color I see that is not, that is not uh, the rhinestones is 310s, which 310s, any crystal rind kit I've ever worked on, the 310s were never rhinestones. They were always just regular 310s. So this is my bags of 30, 27, 28, 29, 30. This one has 31 written on the bag. Again, you got to stop focusing on those masks. I know it blew your, it took your breath away, didn't it? They are selling masks now. Like that's amazing. You can buy the artwork on the mask. So 33, I have two bags of 33. Okay. 36, 35, 25, and 26. 
So that is a lot of colors. But as you know, this is a Van Gogh style, so it's going to be a lot of confetti. So don't let the size fool you. It still might take you a while to get through. But if you can see, you got the greens, and I was expecting a little bit more black. I'm not going to lie, because I thought there would be more black in the image. But mostly, like, the whale here is black. But the rest of it is just, like, a lot of confetti. So let's take a look at the drill field. Nice, clear drill fill. And I think I only had problems maybe with one DIY moon shop. I don't remember which one it was. I want to say it was Rosaline, where the symbols looked a little wonky. But their symbol clar clarity is usually really, really good. And like I said, it does take a while to get your images from this shop. But you got to think that your items are made to order. So they're not sitting on the shelf. So they make them to order and then they do the reverse unboxing all before it gets to you just to make sure that you have everything. And of course, if you are missing something, uh, all you have to do like any other company is contact them and they'll make sure to get it out to you. But like, look, there's like reds for the sunset and well, I think those are pinks. And you have some clear white ones like and there's no need to enhance this one because it's already full rhinestone. So that is awesome. Hold on, I dropped the bag. So that's really cool. I love all the colors, you guys. I can't get over these masks. Cannot get over these masks. We're going to look at some more masks. So yeah, so there is your canvas. Again, it's a 30 by 30 DIY Moon Shops canvases usually do measure the size. So I'm going to trust at the fact that this does measure the size. It is a really, really cute image. And again, I will probably start it right after I finish Eternal Love. So I just want to get these masks out to show you. Uh, I think it's great what they're doing with their artists with the mask promoting safety in the horrible times that we're living in right now. So that's awesome. Sorry, I'm, I'm struggling with plastic today. Today is, today is not the day to be struggling with stuff, I'm telling you. So look at that. Look at the colors, you guys. Oh my gosh. And it does have elastic straps on it. And this part here feels like a very sturdy cloth material so yeah I'm, I'm really excited about that they did an amazing job on the mask and I like the fact that uh it seems like the ink is infused into the cloth and it's not like a vinyl so when you stretch it it doesn't distort the image so yeah, so there you have it, folks. There are our items from DIY Moon Shop. Thank you to the folks over at DIY Moon Shop for sending this over for their new Candy Collective. Candy, which means rhinestone. So again, I will have a special link linked down in the description box of this video if you would be interested in giving this image a try in full rhinestone. I don't know if they're going to offer all of their kits in full rhinestone at some point, but I know for right now you can get this one here, full rhinestone for this size or possibly bigger. Uh, just go to the link that I have linked down below. It'll be the only way you'll be able to get to it. So thank you guys so much for watching. And if you're new to the channel and would like to see more random crazy videos just like this, please feel free to hit that subscribe button and the bell to be notified anytime I randomly decide to put up a video. And believe me, it's random. But with that said, I really must now bid you adieu. But not before reminding you, like I always try to. Real quick, we're going to check to make sure they're, because they, they have a sneaky thing of putting extras in there. So we have the diamonds, canvas, the mask. All right, I think we're good. I think we're good. So now we really are going to bid you adieu. But not before reminding you, like I always try to. Wash your hands, keep your space, don't touch your face, and always try to be kind, be courteous, be cool. Bye, guys.